Oh god, what are you doing, Mr. Mike? Stop that. I really don't remember what happened last time, because I haven't played this game in like a couple days. I don't know what you're thinking, like, this game just came out. Why would you not be playing this? Well, uh, yeah, I've been busy. I've been too busy to play this. Number two, busy to play this. Up in the club. Okay, I'm out of here. You know, this is not a good situation that we are in. Let's go. Let me in! Oh, you don't even know let me in, are you? Mm. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Left. Number two, defend. That's fine. That is just okay with me, then, you know? You know, I'm just gonna be doing that. Okay, that's a grenade! That's a grenade! I gotta throw it back at you. Oh, I'm gonna die. Okay. Mm. That's great. <laughs> that's just great. My mic's in. I don't even care. I got it. Okay. <laughs> This is this is a great way to get back into the color just be rich. Oh my god. Okay, the time is now, enemies of the world. Okay, the time is now for you to be able to listen to me. I guess it's just uh, what you gotta be doing there. You gotta not be trying to kill me there, cause you know this whole killing me thing is not gonna okay, this whole killing me thing is not gonna work out for me, okay? Just what you gotta know. There's now an airplane after it. Okay. Get good, airplane. Um. Oh, okay, that's a good guy. I was gonna say, um, he's right above us. But now I guess we're good. Okay, I guess we're good. We're good. This is a good guy. Okay, hurry up. Defend this thing. Go. We shall hold them off. Okay. That's a grenade. I'm coming! No! Don't leave me! Oh, this is great. <laughs> that's just bundles. Okay, you know, that's typical Call of Duty. You know, I gotta... Oh, hi! Okay, why would you do that? Why would you punch him? Yeah, you was stupid. You got my arms ripped off. Okay, this is not working. This is not, this is not going well, at all. Okay, okay, but no, okay, bye bye arm. I knew it. See, I'm losing my arms over here. Okay, now, um, I would call that a mission fail. <laughs> that was terrible to watch. Oh my god. No, I'm not going to be alright, okay? He, like, broke my leg, ripped off both of my arms, and then punched the crap out of me. I am not going to be okay. Oh, my God. That was disturbing. Get good, kid. I ranked up. Now level two in campaign mode. I'm going to so be an LG. It's okay. Calm down. Just relax. <laughs> I'm so MLG right now. Phase, here I come. I guess you got the objectives. Man's always gonna be better than machine. But unfortunately, you sustain life threatening injuries. You're stable, but you got a long way to go. Who are you? It's me, Taylor. I think it's time you woke up. You, but that's pretty confusing. No, oh my God, my controller's making more noises. Stop it! Hey. No. Oh. Hi. Welcome back. I'm back. Hey, I'm just gonna come and cut again. Yeah. Do you know what's happening to you? Am I dreaming? Let's say you are. Why not just go with it, right? After all, you can always wake up. 
December 12, 2054, 7.30 a.m. We're on board a private commuter train headed to the Zurich headquarters of the Coalescence Corporation. Our uh, cargo, a prototype for the Winslow Accord Neural Network Initiative. At its core, specialized AI software that's capable of rewriting itself in order to interface with any other system in the world. State-of-the-art stuff back in the day. It'd go on to revolutionize a broad range of military and civilian applications. At least, it would have if the train had reached its destination. At 7.31 a.m., a terrorist group detonated an explosive device on board this train. The incident sent back our robotics program several years. You're here to stop it. This isn't real. It can't be. What is happening to me? Right now? Right now you're in a medically induced coma being prepped for surgery. You've got a new bit of hardware inside your head. It's called a direct neural interface, or DNI. I've got one too. That's how I'm able to communicate with you. Your DNI is what connects your mind with your new body and the larger world around you. We're connected. All of this is a simulation inside our minds. And you got a long way to go. Eleven thirty a.m. December eleventh, twenty fifty-four. Zerk security forces receive an anonymous tip, giving them the location of a hideout the terrorists are using. Unfortunately, the ZSF underestimated the firepower these assholes were packing. They got caught with their pants down, and they took it hard. Outcome: train go boom. You remember Diaz? I think so. I'm gonna help get you up to speed on some of the cool new shit you can do. Communication, brother. We all gotta be in sync. Yo, Taylor, you're a fucking dick. You didn't hear shit? If I wanna talk to you, the DNI transmits on a closed channel. I don't even have to think about it. But, uh, just so you know, if you ever think about calling Taylor a dick for real, brother, he's gonna mess you up worse than those robots. All right, let's go see if you can do this without ending up with Swiss cheese like those poor bastards. Okay, we're hot. Start the floor with you, Dad. Right. There's never just one. High, low, left, right. 